This is a video of a full load vibration test on an r and equipment company standard fully assembled blower package. This test allows us to verify that all the equipment is aligned properly, leveled, and the supporting structure is sufficiently designed to operate this equipment in a continuous application. We are using a Haddon Roots 616 Ram blower and a 125 horsepower drive motor operating at a system pressure of 10 pounds. Here we are measuring the vibration level on the drive end of the motor in the horizontal, vertical, and axial plane. The goal of a motor vibration test is to have a fully loaded motor operating at or below 0.15 inches per second. Here we are measuring the vibration level on the drive end of the blower in the horizontal, vertical, and axial plane. The goal of this test for the blower is to have a fully loaded blower operating at or below 0.45 inches per second in the vertical, horizontal, and axial plane. We measure the vibration on the drive end and the non drive end in the blower. Now we move to the non drive end of the motor. After the vibration level of the blower and motor are measured and recorded, we measure the vibration level of the support base in the vertical plane in three locations. The motor end, the center of the package, and at the blower end. The goal is to operate at or below 0.25 inches per second. If any of the numbers we measured during a test exceed specified values, we evaluate the performance, check the equipment for alignment, saw foot, and adjust accordingly. If all equipment is assembled properly, we will meet our vibration goals. This test is performed regularly here at RM. We have in house power to operate motors up to 250 horsepower. For applications above 250 horsepower, we provide an alternate source of energy. We have no limits here and have tested packages up to 1,000 horsepower. 